awesome learners. Join me as we explore the fundamentals of cell and molecular biology. Can you help me to figure out what living things are present nearby? Yes, you're right. There are plants, animal, and human. Do you know that cells come in a tremendous variety of shapes and sizes? That every living thing have thousands, millions, and even trillions of them in an organisms, which contain the fundamental molecules of life. Let's first start with cell biology. Cell biology. Cell biology is the study of cellular structures, molecular pathways within the cells and the cell life cycles. Here are the overviews of structures and organelles within the cell. The cell biology and the cell wall in plants act as the barriers of the cell. The nucleus act as the genetic palace of the cell. The cytoplasm act as the pool area of the cell. The mitochondria act as the energy system of the cell. The plastids act as the crayons in the plant cell. The ribosomes act as the protein factories of the cell. The endoplasmic reticulum act as the network channels and factories of the cell. The Golgi bodies act as the packaging center of the cell. The lysosomes act as the cleanup crews of the cell. The vacuole act as the storage tank in the cell. Cytoskeleton act as the framework of the cell. The cilia and flagella act as the mobility mechanism in the animal cell. In all, cell biology revolves around the concept of the cell as the fundamental unit of life. Next is the molecular biology. Molecular biology. Molecular biology is the study of living things at the levels of molecules that contain them in the cell. It seeks to understand how living things work and use this knowledge to develop treatments when living things do not work well. Molecules form the basis of life processes. This is what we call the biomolecules that produced by cells which vary in sizes, structures, and functions to perform. There are four major biomolecules, namely carbohydrates, lipids, proteins, and nucleic acid. Their main purposes are for structure energy storage and release, protective layers and information storage and communication. Fusing the two study make an interdisciplinary field of science, which deals in structure, chemistry and biology, as it seeks to understand the life and cellular processes at the molecular level and understand cell behaviors of systems biology. These are all for today. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoy and learn from this video. Goodbye.